making it not look like shit, but it has all the crafting stuff, and that was the main goal. Looks like a good starting off point to me. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Did you just build all, all that in, in his world? No, so the fun part about this game, when you join in, whatever great tree you've claimed and what you've built on it, oh, yeah, you're comes with you. You're telling me that I forgot. Mm -hmm. I forgot. Are you taking the mushrooms down, Dave? Yeah, I was just seeing... If we can get to your grave? Yeah. I'll follow you. I'm exploring. So to claim a tree, you have to climb all the mushrooms. That makes sense. And you have fall damage. Yes, you do. How do you get out first person? Oh, Z. Is that cool, though? You can play first person mode. I didn't even know that was the thing. That was like the first thing I stopped and grounded. Well, let's fix this. <laughs> it's easier to look. Especially over the edge. I wanna fall down. Give me my grounded powers. Okay, Kevin. You need a clover. I need a clover. You could fall to this. I made it. I'm a gamer. So my stuff is down there. I just don't know where. At least we can jump bar. Yes. With the wings, Kevin, does it help you glide too? So you don't take as much glide or fall damage? You take no fall damage if you glide. Oh, nice. There it is. There's my stuff. I see. Where? On the edge of the big piece of lo uh, log right here. So if I run around that way. You can see it. It glows. You skateboard? I almost slid. Ha ha ha! Woo! That was a small land. Oh. I ran around a tree for five hours. Oh, oh, oh! I'm dead. Nope. I fell. The way down? Yeah. He looks alive, though. He does look alive. I am alive. That defeats the purpose. I wanted to. Where were you trying to jump to? Um, I was running, and I thought it was a surface I could stick to and I slid off of it. Were you trying to jump to this light or the branch over here? Yeah, it might be to my benefit. No, it's not. No, maybe it is. Screw you butterflies.
It's not very nice to butterfreeze like you. Butterfreeze. I don't like edible mushrooms. Do I get trippy in this? No, but you can cook them into mushroom steaks. You know what vegan people think are equivalent to meat? Yes. You're saying vegans made this game. I, f I feel like the people from Fern Gully made this game. <laughs> they got high and watched a lot of Fern Gully. Mm hmm. And then when they fell asleep, their meat eater friend came in and started making all kinds of changes. I need food. Okay, what else am I? My stuff. You want, to cook, want to cook those mushrooms? I do. Oh. Real grasshopper legs. Yeah. Ooh. What if we're going to get a storm? It's raining. Well, I get lucky. You done cooking? Yeah. So my stuff... Across here. Kind of cool how everything comes back really quick. What's that L over there? L means lost. You little lost. I see the lights going over there. Like I need to go to that L for some reason to figure out the story. Do we have a carry weight? I don't believe so. Just an inventory space. Yeah, I saw that. So that's nice. Okay, cool. They have lights here, they want me to go... Down this way. Screw you, ants. I don't understand why I can't swim. Dramatic music. Cutscene. Whoa, whoa, three ants. I normally can take on two. Can they climb everything? Yeah. Oh, okay, good. <laughs> I I don't know. I don't I didn't have an answer for you. Well, whoever said that, that was very sweet of you. Thank you. Okay. Alright, let's see. Have you been to the cell yet? Marcus? Mm, the big one? Yes. Come on, folk. Yep. We bells possess magical powers. Okay, cool. That was boring. Came up here for that. You did. Should I have this guy make me some new armor? And which one's better, padded or light? Padded armor or light armor? And you mean you can't jump off of things and land in the water? Come on, small land. Protection one. 
movement speed. Oh! Almost so. Uh, I keep running off the edge. I'm gonna die one day. You can't jump on leaves. I learned that the hard way. So is there certain areas, Kevin, some areas get harder than others? Uh, technically. Okay. There's definitely certain mobs that are tougher. So sad I can't run in this water. They have beautiful water in this game. Mana bowler pickaxe are better? Or break you? We'll break you. I guess these rocks can you run across cross water? No. They tease me. Needs a crude hatchet. You guys are teasing me down here. What are these settlers I'm supposed to be looking out for? Random people you find throughout the map. Oh, okay. When you die, do you uh, lose everything? It depends on what Marcus set the world at. Oh, but yes. yes. I didn't change that. Sure. Well, I can change it next time we get in. I forgot how much you die. I die a lot. Yeah, I forgot. I'm not gamers like you guys. No, you're a, you're a better gamer than me because you go exploring and put yourself into situations where you die. I just run away. Poisonous mushroom. Try eating it, see? That's something you would do, that's not something <laughs> I would do. <laughs> Oh, grasshopper. Are they deadly? Are they vicious? Do they attack? I think everything does, except for butterfreeze. What about ladybugs? I, I think everything does, except for butterfreeze. <laughs> okay, ladybugs just ran past me. That's what I was asking. Smart ass. The ladybugs are much smaller in this game than they are in Grounded. Yeah, I feel you're like much, I'm really tall. I was going to say, you're much bigger than a, a grounded character. Are we? Oh, yeah. Are we like double the size of a grounded character? I, probably more than that, truthfully. Yeah, I, I guess based on the grass, you're right. Ladybug level 6, Ladybug level 10, Ladybug level 1. But I they didn't used to have levels, which is awesome that they added it. No, come back here, I wanted to kill you. Like, I need a really powerful weapon to kill him, or an axe? I'm sorry, a bow, I meant. Grasshopper! He didn't attack me. Ooh! What is that? A big ant. Is that a big ant? So, what's edible? 
insect fat. That's a big ant. Black <laughs> blackberries. Edible mushroom. Bugs limp. Oh, I can't. Nourishment can heal. Behind you, Marcus. Oh. Holy crap, what is this big animal trying to get me? Ah! Oh. Thank you. And how do you use it? Let's put that in there. You're on a bar or you can like... Oh, wait. I'm by an anthill? What is this? And does it progress? Yes, it does. Okay, cool. Yeah, it's a heal over time. Ah, there's a heavy attack, too. I didn't notice that. Do you grasshoppers... Do grasshoppers what, what, what? kill ants? Don't think so. And their grasshoppers are usually friendly during the day, but at night they get all cranky. Hey, so right. they must they must have done something to the ladybugs because they I walked through a whole pile of them and they didn't attack me. Ladybugs during the day, also friendly. At night, ah. not so much. Okay, good to know. It's been a minute since I've played, honestly. That's fine. I, I just sharing what I learned. Um, why are those ants so friggin' big? The bull ants? Yeah, I didn't have time to check them out. Did you run? Yeah. Ooh. There are three They're of where them. You get... Playing like me. They're where you get bull ant mandibles. To make that pickaxe you were talking about earlier to break your rocks. Oh, look at you. Where are you at? Oh, you're over there. How do we know whose trees who... How do you spend your attribute points? That's new too. Um, you highlight it, hit the plus button, hit apply. But how do you so get you to? Is it in? Oh, you guys are right through the fire. You guys are over there. That's what tree is that? Marcus, pick up the mushrooms and cook some steaks. Oh, well, I was cooking my uh, my ants. Hey, really, really, oh. really quick. Uh, is your house like have a balloon in it? Is that what I see? Yes. The, ele the elevator. Oh, mm -hmm. that's cool. So it just cooks it right away. You don't have to wait for it. But each of these big trees you see, Dave, like mine is um, more to the south. Uh huh. This one right next to us is a different tree. If you climb to the top of it, you can claim this tree as your grape tree. Nice. I like grapes. Yeah, that's Ooh, exactly So now I, now I have mushroom steaks. I, I can't be funny? You absolutely can. Uh-oh, I'm being hit by some. Uh oh What was it? Let's get it. <laughs> no, Dave, make, do you have some food? Did you make food? Yeah, I have been. I've been collecting them. There's some more mushrooms on the ground. I do recommend you guys walk around with enough material to always be able to make a workbench. I like the cooking in this. It doesn't take you very long. In fact, it's real time. It's real time. So each one of these trees that you see with the mushrooms is a great tree. It's a great tree. Okay. So how many? There seems to be a lot of them then. There are quite a bit of them. Cool. All right. So if one of you wants this tree, we just climb to the top. Yeah. Dave, let's one of us take this tree. Yeah. I don't care who. You can take this one. I'll take the next one. Or I'll take this one. You can take the next one. Cool. Campfire unlocked, workbench unlocked, simple bed unlocked, simple chest unlocked. Okay. Is that by opening up the hammer? Yep. Okay, so you guys are going this way? Just around the tree to find the initial way up. Wild strawberry. Take, oh. take that I, shit. I feel like it's always opposite of you. I need a hatchet. What is that? What is what? Uh, something... Jack... Screaming over here? 
uh, Kevin was killing something. What's Ants that? tried to bite me. What's this? Was it a raspberry? Raspberry? Oh, raspberries. Is there anything in here? That's an yeah. anthill. What's that tree with a... Uh, do we have neighbors? There's like a little door what? in that tree. Uh, I don't know. Oh man. Are these uh... Bull ants hard to kill? Uh oh. Did we go the wrong way? I don't know. I have yet to try and kill one. Gotta go Dave's way. I don't know. Gotta find the path that goes up. This might be over here. Or blind. There's. Oh, we start on this side. Where'd Dave go? I'm right by you. Trying to figure out. Here. Trying to figure out things. You see yeah. that? What is this? Examine. Wait, I can claim the tree right here? Usually it tells you you have to go up top first. But it says, it. I want to claim this tree and move my tree equipment here. Go for it. You do not have tree encampment yet. To claim your first tree, you must climb to the top. Oh, okay. Dave got his head stuck in some bubble gum at some point. I sure did. You trying? Are you flirting with me? Because I'm a girl. Nope. You do a I'm bad job. You do a bad job at it. Oh, that's, that's all I got. Third, third grade, uh, like love punching on the arms is still my flirt tactic. You just jump up there, huh? Just easy like that. Is there a double jump? <laughs> no. It's all about the angle you hit them. Okay, I see. Well, not only that, but he'll um, kind of float over him. I'm still curious what's in the tree and what that little house is right there. Or little camera looking. Yeah, that's a camera. All the voyeurs. The cameras are crawled up. Now the people watching you. Nice. If it rains and you're on the floor, do you get washed away? Uh, it hasn't happened yet. That'd be sweet. That'd be an added element for sure. Yep. Why aren't you a developer? Because I'm not smart enough. In my eyes, you are. In your eyes. Think it. Your That's eyes. all I got. I don't know if you guys listen to new music anymore because most of the new music kind of sucks, especially rock music. But have you heard of a band called Falling in Reverse? Yes. Have you heard their cover of Papa Roach's Last Resort? Um, I think I have. But Falling in Reverse, haven't they been around for like 10 years? It's, they might have. I'm, I'm not sure. I don't. I've never heard of them until recently. And then I heard their cover, and I wanted to gouge my ears out with pencils. <laughs> I never wanted to hear again. But then I also didn't want that the last thing I heard. The dilemma. Yeah, they're not a fun band. 
It was so bad. It was the worst cover I think I've ever heard. <laughs> you made it, Marcus. Is Dave still coming up? Yeah, I don't know if I'm going the right way. I'm just running up mushrooms. You probably are. Yeah, you're almost here. Do you want this tree? Sure, I'll take your tree. Okay, I'll take the next yeah, one. Take his wood. Uh, I'm going to need to take a break here to walk these animals real quick. I think this is a good point since we're here. Yes. Bring some wooden fiber, Dave, to make yourself a hut. Uh, let's see what I can do. I can drop you mine, too, if you want. Alright, so where do I make it here? Oh, Anywhere here. on the tree itself will carry into any other world you go into. Okay. Do you need more materials? Let's see. Crafting. Hatchet club. Wait. Any day. I don't know. I have 86 wood. Nice. A hey. 130 resin. The recipes opened up. Where do I? How do I go into crafting? Pull out your building hammer. Mm. Just like all hype. Okay, I'll be back in like 10 minutes-ish. Oh, okay. Enjoy the walk. Did you talk to this tree effigy thing over here and claim it as yours, Dave? Sure did. Alright. Then it's yours. Ooh, craft page! The most important thing in this game, craft bench. Yep. Okay, so those are green. Okay. Get out of here. Ladybug travel kit. Repair stuff. Yeah, I just repaired all my stuff. Probably because I died so many times. Okay. I don't. Okay, so that's just for weapons. What's this? Oh, your tree is private. I mean, I know what it means, but I don't know how to turn it off yet. Talk to the same thing you talked to when you claimed it. Okay, so when I die, I spawn back here. Nice. Like Valheim, mm -hmm. anything that's not covered in a roof takes uh, weather damage. You need to be sheltered to sleep. Okay. I can spawn back here. Okay, where? Oh, he's over here. So he's private. Let's see. Uh, I want to make my tree public. Cool. I think I can use your workbench to repair. Yeah. I'll be right back. I'm going to give me some salsa.
Whoa, 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 whoa. Calm down here, little guy. See all the new subs we got, Kevin? Or all the new movies we got on our subs? I haven't yet. Does she add a bunch? The Flash, Gardens, uh, Galaxy of the Guardians 3, um, Little Mermaid. Um, Asteroid City. The new Wes Anderson movie. Oh uh, yeah. Flash was good. Was it? Yeah, like I wasn't blown away by it, but I was really entertained. I enjoyed the TV show. Mm-hmm. I did, too. I thought he did a pretty good job of being Flash. I was... <clears throat> it was a surprise considering how few of the actual TV shows out of those I liked. Yeah. I agree with you. All, everything that branched off of the Flash, I didn't watch. I tried Arrow, meh. I tried Iron Fist, meh. Uh, Jessica Jones was excellent. Yep. <clears throat> the downside is she kind of set the bar. Mm, her and a Daredevil. Didn't care for. Well, let me phrase that. I didn't care for the character in Daredevil. I loved Kingpin. I yeah. thought he did excellent. Yeah. But it's really hard to beat that guy. He's just... Fuck, he's a good actor. But, yeah, I cared less about the main character, honestly. Have you ever seen uh, Old Boy? Negative. So it's a Japanese movie, and then um, the guy who plays Thanos re redid it here in America. It's really Wait a good. Minute. Yes, I have. Yes, I have. The American version was dumb. The original is amazing. Like most. Well, I mean, yeah, that's kind of how it goes. But you know the f fight scene with uh, when he comes out of the elevator in the hallway. Yeah, the hallway fight scenes. Yeah, that kind of became a cliche after Old Boy. Yep, I like that in Daredevil how they mirrored that fighting. I know what you're referring to. Just like that old school fight. Mm -hmm. Where you get tired halfway through, but you keep going. It's nice when they actually portray it correctly. Like, a lot of these people are so goddamn superhuman, even in non-superhero you know superhero movies, that they fight for 25 minutes and they're not winded. Yeah. I'm actually excited for uh, the Daredevil remake. Or, I guess it wouldn't be a remake, it would be extension of his universe.